nothing better than cold ice cream on a hot, sticky day, unless it's your own homemade ice cream. Now, if you've ever had homemade ice cream, you know there's nothing better than that in the whole wide world. It tastes so good and so authentic. It doesn't have all the preservatives and all the gunk in it. And everybody smiles when they're eating homemade ice cream. What is the problem, though? If you've ever tried doing it the traditional way, you got to get a whole bunch of ice cubes and rock salt, and then you got to crank for about 20 hours. We did it one time in my family, and that was the first, last, and only time my family made homemade ice cream when I was growing up because it took forever. Now, you come up with a second alternative, and the second alternative alternative is you got to take this thing and you got to have it in the freezer and you got to hurry up and you got to throw it in a machine because you've got to use it while that container's cold. Well, Wolfgang has changed everything. You don't need rock salt, you don't crank, and you don't need to pre-freeze an inner container. You literally, and for the vanilla ice cream, here it is, heavy cream, whole milk, granulated sugar, and a teaspoon of vanilla ex extract. You throw it in here, you turn the button on, you choose do I want soft ice cream or hard ice cream, and then you walk away and let it do its job. It actually has a very unique freezing system that is built in. So no prepping anything. You throw it in and out comes the most sweetest, most delicious, fabulous ice cream, and it's perfect timing to have this as our today special. We've got four colors. The white was the only one we had in February when it was $20 more and it sold out. So we brought the white back. Now, look at the colors we've added. They're fabulous. This is the mint green color. We have the fabulous red that everybody loves red. And then finally, who doesn't love aqua? This is our turquoise or aqua color. Again, couldn't be simpler, and yet the results are amazing. And here, I'm going to prove it, and then Wolfgang's going to join me. But look at this. Does this, look, look, oh, does that not make your mouth water? Do you not want to dig into that? and just put it in a cone, put it in a bowl, whatever it takes, grab a spoon and have at it. That is, and my gosh, you guys, that is the freshest strawberry ice cream I have ever smelled in my life. All right, so here we go. We are now gonna go out to Los Angeles, California, to the home of Wolfgang Puck, and he's joining me live from LA. Wolfgang Chef, it is so good to see you tonight. Hello. Hello, I'm so glad to be able to talk to you from so far away. I wish I would be with you over in Tampa, or wherever you are in the swamps over there. I'm here on, in Hollywood, on Hollywood Boulevard, right where we do our Oscar party, and it's so exciting. And you know, even for the Oscar party, which is normally in February, we always make a lot of ice cream. Now you can make it at home as well as we do in our restaurant. So this is really the first time I bought, I bought you this two pint thermoelectric ice cream maker. So you don't have to worry about putting the bowl in the freezer. You don't have to put rock salt in or churn it by hand. This does everything. You can pour in your liquid, your custard, your fruit juice, watch a movie, come back, and have the most delicious ice cream. Now, should I show you some of it? It is so amazing. You know, yes. I love sweet things. <laughs> and ice cream, it is the best. Can you see in here? I have a mint chocolate ice oh, cream right in here. It's no. still churning. Wow, oh. look at that. Let me, can you see it? Look at that. Oh my. <laughs> mm. I can't wait to taste it, but you know what? I have a cone here. I'm having an ice cream party. So I take it right out, fill up my cone. Look at that. Just like in an ice cream store. I mean, it's amazing. Oh my God. What did you say in the movie? Remember there was a movie out, Sleepless in Seattle or something like that? Where she said, I'm having what you are having. And she was moaning along. This is, oh my God. <laughs> Nothing better than it's, ice cream. It's, mm. so, it's so good. And I, I'm telling you, right here from the studio, it couldn't be easier. All right, guys, let me already give you an update. We're 30 seconds into the new day. Already the red is completely taking off. This is your first time you've ever seen the mint, the red, or the uh, aqua. Now, here's what I want to point out, and this is a really big deal. Not only was it $20 more in February when it sold out, you did not have five flex pays. That is literally the lowest 
lowest price and only five flex pays today. And get this, this is even better. We're shipping it for free. So how much is our shipping? It's almost, what, a little over $14. So right now, if you have a major credit card or PayPal, you can use your credit card and take advantage of that five flex pay. But you know what I love, Chef, so much about this? Is everybody loves homemade ice cream because it doesn't have all the preservative. There's something so delicious about it. But it's always been hard, Chef, and complicated, and nobody's yeah. got time for it. I love the fact that you just throw the ingredients in, literally walk yeah. away, and it's done. Totally. It is so easy. You have three buttons. One is on and off, one is soft ice cream, and one is harder ice cream. So, so simple. Can you see that here? Look at that. So, then all you do put, put your liquid in this container here. You can see I'm going to show you one from the beginning. And put the motor on top, and that's it. Beautiful ice cream. Great consistency. That's what I love about this ice cream maker. So if you want, take that out, put it in a container in the freezer, and you have it whenever you want. You know, I know my kids at home, they love ice cream. Now here, I have raspberry ice cream. Mm. Look at the color <laughs> and look how beautiful. No preservatives. Oh, I actually added a little honey instead of sugar. Look at it. Wow. That's great. Look at it. You could not go to any ice cream store and get better ice cream. You know what? At Spago, it's the same. The same as we have here. And if you don't have recipes at home, you can use any recipes. Marion made a beautiful book with me. Yep. I actually did the introduction and we both love sweets. You know all Marianne down in Tampa. Yes, she we do. She is our pastry chef and she is amazing. So and you I, get I wanna, the recipe. Chef, let me show these guys the, it real quick. It's 112 pages and it's got the cutest recipes. There's a keto one. How about a sugar-free lemon sorbet, sour cream, yeah. cherry ice cream. So it's not just, it's the basics, but then she just totally goes, uh, just look on frozen margarita. Hello. Talking about the right ice cream. That ain't ice cream, honey. That's a drink right there. But I love it. Plum I sorbet, yeah. ice cream s'mores, tropical mango sorbet. So chef, that's pretty cool because you can do a sorbet if you want you can do a frozen drink exactly. if you want or you can do traditional ice cream if you want and that's an awesome that's, options to have you are so right that's you can great. do anything in here look at that i have <laughs> chocolate ice cream in here and then if you love what i do chocolate ice cream with a little caramel sauce on top nice and then we sprinkle chocolate on top. Look at that. This is like a restaurant dessert. So easy to do, no problem at all. So, and it comes right out just like that, see? That's great, Chef. Really easy, and it's two pints. This is the only small compressor ice cream maker which is over two pints. So That's it's great. really perfect for your home use. Hey, so Chef, you know what I just discovered is, too, Chef? Is you can do frozen yeah. yogurt in here. So there we go. Margarita, totally. yeah. frozen yogurt, sorbet, yeah. ice cream. And all you do is throw the ingredients yeah. in and you walk away. No churning, no rock salt, no pre-freezing, some kind of weird container that you forget about. And mm. here we go. If you want the red, by far it's outselling all the other colors. Please remember when Chef launched this, it was back in February. And Chef, that makes me laugh. February, it's freezing yeah. everybody, everywhere. People wanted to make ice cream. So the white sold out. You know. It was $20 more. There was not flex pay. We didn't have free shipping. We brought in three brand new colors tonight and we brought yeah. the white back but again here's my best advice at the way this is going right now and we are crazy busy at this point I would totally get the color use the five flex and the free shipping if you don't absolutely love the results I mean have ice cream for 30 days and if you don't love it you send it yeah. back we're going to refund your money and chef I'm just going to show mine right here again I take it to my house <laughs> oh I'm sure you do uh -huh. and I bet your young boys yeah. love this don't they uh, they love it you know when my young boys go to cut in Las Vegas, hello everybody in cut in Las Vegas, they eat for dessert an ice cream sandwich. So we have chocolate chip cookie, put a little ice cream in the center here, like that. Oh, great. And then we squish them together a little bit and here you have the perfect <laughs> ice cream sandwich. That's oh, awesome. You know what? I'm gonna eat this whole thing, I'm gonna gain 
a little weight, I think, so tonight, but it's <laughs> worth it because it's so delicious. By the end and of the day, I he's gained like 20 pounds. <laughs> no, 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 no. But you know what is good? It's all natural ingredients. No yeah, preservatives, yeah. no things in there which are not good for your body. You know, when you Great look point. at this ice cream you buy, you have gums, you have this and preservatives and everything. Here is just milk, cream, on the uh, fruit juice, you want a little uh, tequila or a little rum in it, it or a little anything you like, that's perfect. So everything is all natural. It's the ingredients you like. Yes. Oh, oh it's so and easy. You know, what, one ahead. of my favorite desserts, still I remember from my childhood, is the banana split. <laughs> you know, you use vanilla ice cream, bring me my banana. <laughs> While he's doing that, we have more here. Who doesn't love a banana split, chef? Come on. <laughs> I know. Everybody loves it. Now, look at that. So if you want, you can put that just like that in the freezer and then take it out when you want it. Or take out all the ice cream, all the sorbet, and put it wherever you like. So this is really perfect. So make it a day in advance, two days in advance, and it's so simple to do. Look, all I do is put my container right in here. Then here I have a little raspberry sorbet, like over two pints. And then we're gonna put our cover on. You can see it says front here, so simple. So you put that right in here, turn it to the left, and put it on, on, and then turn it on hard and let it turn. So easy, so simple. Oh, that's the beauty All right, of now it. Here, yeah. Now here, I'm gonna make my banana split with chocolate sauce, nuts on it and everything. All right, put that on the bottom. Okay, I'm gonna take that out. Oh, hold up. Okay, now we put the banana right on top here. And then chocolate sauce, where's my chocolate sauce here? Put chocolate sauce over it. Mm. For the whole family. That's fun. <laughs> And, and you know what, then, do we have a little whipped cream? Hey, Chef, you, right, you, chef right. you know what's really cool about this? Is I'll never forget when my family, we made that homemade ice cream. We only did it one time. It was rock salt. We had to crank it. It was a hot mess, right? I know. But you know what I remember? I vi and that was when I was a really little girl. It's one of my most treasured memories is working exactly. with my family and cranking that and actually coming out with real ice cream. We thought it was so amazing. And I vividly, vividly remember that to this day. And now you just do it the modern fast way, but you'll still create the those memories. Yeah. Maybe it's the holiday yeah. weekend. Maybe it's the vacation you're going to take in a month or two. Maybe it's because we're all stuck at home and you've got the family together and you all want to make your favorite ice cream. Maybe you make one ice cream for one kid and another ice cream for the grandkids. It's just such a wonderful thing to be able to do. And again, here's why it's so popular already. Launched this in February, sold out only white. It was $20 more, no free shipping, no five flex pays. Tonight, we reduced to $20, free shipping, five flex, wow you can get it. White, launched in February, sold out. Brand new mint, brand new red, brand new aqua. The red is by far outselling the other colors. And as he showed you, it couldn't be simpler. Throw in the ingredients, you plug it in, you hit power, and then you only choose, do I want soft or hard ice cream? Literally, can you guys see that? I'm going to show you guys it from the top. Only because it's so simple. I like stuff simple. It doesn't have a timer. You don't have to worry about a bunch of buttons. You don't have to digitally figure out the temperature. Literally throw it in, decide what you want to do and walk away. And you're going to have delicious homemade ice cream. And you're going to create the most amazing memories for you, your partner. If you've got a family, that's great for the grandkids. What a neat thing to do. And you know, chef, since we're all pretty much stuck inside yet again, you know, it's really neat to be able yeah. to create some special memories around such a family favorite. It's ice cream you absolutely it is so amazing because you have people come over or you just want to watch a movie late at night at home yeah what better treat for yourself than eating some ice cream i know i love it now i eat a lot of sorbet too like here i have a strawberry sorbet i get my little ice cream uh, thing i take out my little paddle which makes the ice cream churn or the sorbet churn and then just fill it up with your ice cream or your sorbet. Here we have strawberry sorbet, so you can 
decide what food you like the best. Maybe sprinkle a few little berries on top here, or maybe a little decoration when the kids come over. So it's beautiful, it's easy, and you can make your own desserts. You can add a few blueberries to it if you like to. Okay, see how simple, how easy, and you can add a little alcohol to it if you would like a little rum in the sorbet is good. Yeah. So with this machine, you can be a pastry chef, you can be an ice cream maker. And in our restaurant in Orlando, in uh, Disney Springs, we have a whole ice cream store. Yeah. And you know, two ice creams cost you a flex pay here. So you get it for <laughs> how much at home and free shipping too. Yeah, $29.99, free shipping, a one day price, $20 off the launch price. And by the way, this is the first and only ice cream maker today special we've done in the history of HSN. All right, a couple yeah. things. And, and Chef, I'm gonna get Marion into the game here in just a second. Don't forget how to, her book, you're gonna meet Marion in one second. It's 112 pages, sorbets, sorbets, ice cream, yogurts you can do with this, margaritas, Alcohol, like frozen drinks if you want to. It's all in a recipe book, although Chef has put a whole bunch of recipes in the book that comes with it. You also get the little Scoopy spatula. That's included with our configuration tonight. And I just want to point out, you got to have an ice cream scoop, right? We have a set of three from Chef available to go back to this. So please ask about those. I've got a couple of colors. We'll stick the information for you up on the screen. So if you want to get these scoops that Chef and I are both working with, they're available. Here's the information. Three different sizes. I love of that for your ice cream or your melon balls or whatever you're making. And there they are, $22.95 and of course, four flex pays. So now we're gonna go here in Florida and join sous chef and pastry chef, Marion, who's joining us. Hi, Marion, it's good to see you again. I miss you guys. <laughs> Hi, we miss you. <laughs> oh, well, tell me, what do you love about this? Because honestly, your recipe surprised me and really shows us how many different things you can do inside this machine. I love it because it's so darn cute. And honestly, with all the sadness that we've had around, it's hard to find something that brings a little bit of joy. And those happy colors, oh my gosh, I was so excited. But that you don't have to add salt or ice, that there's nothing to struggle to get into the freezer amongst all the other stuff that we're storing and just hope that the thing gets frozen before you make the ice cream. And I love that there's not a big compressor. It's so great that this new technology exists and Wolfgang loves that, right? He loves to innovate, but that you just add your stuff. It's kind of like your slow cooker. It does it slowly, but that slow paddle, I just love how it makes that texture of the ice cream perfect. Mm -hmm. Now, what's your favorite thing to do? Because I was so surprised it could do a yogurt, sorbet, ice cream, and drinks, hello. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, my favorite, I love sorbet as well. Greg likes vanilla because it's that perfect canvas for everything. True. But honestly, even when the grandkids are over, which it, it's been a long time since we've seen them, but even a smoothie, something that maybe you're tired of eating, once you freeze it, something totally different. Oh, true. That's a great idea too. And again, love, love, love the book. There's so many clever ideas. You even did a sugar-free recipe inside here. There's yogurt recipe, um, sugar-free vanilla, uh, chocolate avocado ice cream. How, that's so gourmet that on that one. That one's one of my favorites it's... of all. <laughs> You'll never know that it has avocado and all that stuff in it. It is just decadent. How about cinnamon candy ice cream, chocolate sorbet, carnival ice cream, Peanut caramel chocolate waffle ice cream sandwiches. Come on, <laughs> now that's that's a treat right there. Now you guys are loving the book, and I will tell you, we have a whole lot less of the book than we do the machines. In fact, here's what's interesting. I expected that we would bring in a ton of machines, like thousands and thousands, because hello, it's ice cream season, right? We didn't. I was actually really surprised at how few we have for the whole day. But again, I have fewer of Marion's book if you'd like to pick that up. All right, now we're gonna hop back to LA because Chef Wolfgang Puck is gonna share with us some more ideas. So chef, what are you gonna show us next? Now you saw me making the sandwich, the ice cream sandwich, and now I'm gonna make you one of my favorite desserts I have for a Sunday lunch at home. So I make the vanilla ice cream in here, and that's enough for a table of six. And then put it up like that, and then I pour a little coffee on it, just like that. Can I, it, it's better if you put it in a little thing. All right, so you pour coffee over your ice cream and then add a little whipped cream. Where's my whipped cream? You took it away already, okay. 
<laughs> so you have, in the Italians call it affegato. You probably heard about that. Okay, put a little whipped cream on top. Oh, and nice. sprinkle a little chocolate on top. And you have a delicious dessert. It's easy and so fast to do. So if you have kids over, grown up people over, whoever comes, you can get it right away. And here we have another one is my mango sorbet. Who doesn't like mango? So if I have mangoes at home and they are overripe, I puree them in my blender and then, and then when I want to make ice cream, I churn it in my ice cream machine here. Look at that. It's a great idea. Yeah, so simple, so easy. All right, just like in a restaurant or in an ice cream salon in somewhere in Italy. You know, you can make the Italian gelato in here if you like to, sorbets, ice cream, yogurt, whatever you desire. Yo frozen yogurt, exactly. That's, Look, that's awesome. In no time here, I made delicious little ice creams, like in an ice cream store. And guys, I just so, want to show you just how simple and easy this is. And Chef, I'm going to give him a quick update a on what we have. So easy vanilla ice cream. That's the one Marion said was her favorite. You guys, it's heavy cream, whole milk, granulated sugar, and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Now, you know that's going to be better than any store-bought ice cream because it's going to taste authentic and fresh. In the store-bought stuff, they've got to add a lot of preservatives, a lot of weird stuff because it's got to sit on shelves or in the frozen section forever and ever. Here, you're making it fresh to order. And then you jazz it up or you add the stuff you want to it. So here's what we've got. Please remember, this is what happened. Chef launched this in February, and I think it's hilarious that he launched an ice cream maker and it sold out in one of the coldest months of the year. So everybody jumped on it because it was so innovative because literally there's no pre-prep. There's no cranking, no rock salt, no having to pre-freeze some kind of container and then throw it in here. So that's why it sold out. It sold out at $20 more. It did not have five flex and free shipping. We dropped it $20 tonight, added the flex, added the free shipping. So you're getting by far our best foot forward on this. And the timing's perfect. Then what we did is we added three brand new colors tonight. So now we have the mint, we have the red, and we have the aqua. The red is on fire. It's red, it's on fire. That makes sense, right? But think about it too. How many of you have that awesome memory surrounding ice cream? Whether it's going for me, my dad used to give us a dime and he would take us in the car one time a week in the summertime, one on the weekend, and we would were allowed to get a dime of ice cream at the ice cream shop. Well, again, that was such a treat, but I have such fond memories of that with my family. That one and only time we actually hand cranked ice cream, it was the most delicious ice cream I'd ever eaten in my entire life. And it's a vivid memory, and I remember that now. Heck, I can't remember what I had for lunch today, but I vividly remember how much fun it was making homemade ice cream and kind of the mini miracle it is. You're like, oh my gosh, these little loose ingredients come out so yummy. But create those memories either for yourself, for your family, your loved ones, your partner, or if you're hanging on your own, can you imagine on call, you're now gonna make homemade ice cream. Again, this is a fabulous uh, strawberry ice cream. I'm gonna show it to you again, look at this. <gasps> Like, come on, look at how yummy that is. Yeah, you totally want to eat this, right? Look at, oh, that is so good. And it's easy, easy to do. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to check back in with Chef once again. He's got some more ideas for us. So out to LA we go. Chef, what are some of the other thoughts you have on this? Oh, uh, well, I have a great idea for you here. So here I have a coffee ice cream. You Ooh. know, it's vanilla ice cream with coffee in it, with espresso i love espresso but you can use your coffee you like just make it really strong and then pour it in something and what i like let's say not for the kids but for me put a little whiskey or a little grand manier on top and have that for dessert and you say oh my god i don't need the dishes steve i just have my ice cream with a little booze on it, and we are done. So you can obviously garnish it with chocolate. If you like coffee, I have some coffee bits here, put that on it. If you like a little color, a few red berries on here, and you're done. And you have the most amazing dessert. And um, you know, no hassle, no rock salt in here, no putting your container in the freezer. This has 
a really an amazing motor in here with the with the two chips in here so that way it really freezes it really well so you get the best of both worlds yeah easy to use and perfect perfect ice cream yeah you gotta love it okay now in the actual book that you get with it the booklet there's ice cream recipes sorbet and look at this even a vegan chocolate ice cream recipe is here if you want to know how to do the yogurts and some of the other more uh, gourmet ice creams then you definitely want to pick up marion's book now here's what's happened we've sold almost 300 in this airing i will guarantee you the book's going to sell out before our day ends okay so if you want they're wonderful recipes too she covers everything including yogurt yogurt, which I love that because you're like, how do you make homemade yogurt? She even did a really cool keto chocolate ice cream recipe. If you're doing keto, I'm not even going to show you the recipe. You got to buy the book. You are trying to stop your screen right now and take a picture of that, aren't they? We all know you're trying to get that keto recipe. Nope. You got to get the book. <laughs> They're like, they're like, that is so mean, Suzanne. Well, you know, it's in the book. And Marion's worked really hard. She always does. And Wolfgang uh, did, did the uh, intro on this too. She puts out great cookbooks. Don't miss out. Again, white, brand new mint, brand new red, brand new aqua, fabulous fresh ice cream on demand with very little effort. You know, Chef, what's really funny, other than the, the well, actually for most people, we would have all four ingredients for vanilla ice cream in their cabinet or fridge right now. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Mm. It's so easy, so simple. Yeah. I tell you, Susan, if you go home late tonight, have the coffee ice cream with a little grand manier on top and it's the <laughs> wine. Oh my God, you will see. <laughs> Give some to your husband and he will not fall asleep for sure. <laughs> So a little tip it from Wolfgang. It's so good. Look at that. I just, <laughs> I just keep on eating and eating and eating. I love it. Okay, uh, Chef. Marion, Marion, this should be illegal. I know Marion's still there. We're going to go to her in just a second. Potato chip caramel ice cream. Potato chip. Look, I'm being so bad not showing the recipe. Look at that. Potato chip ice cream. Okay, that's got to be fabulous. So Marion's good to go. We're going to go back to her home. And Marion, uh, you've got about 30 seconds before we're going to move on, but give us another thought really quickly about this machine and why you like it so much. All the things that you miss so much from not going out. One of my favorites right now is on page 20 in the book. It's movie theater ice cream. All those treats, including the popcorn that you love to have when, in the time when we used to go to movies, Mix that into the vanilla. Just mix it in and just enjoy it. It has all the taste. That's what's so great about making your own at home, Suzanne, is you're in charge of what's in the machine yep. and then all those goodies that we love from all the pints that we buy. Yeah, all right, so we're gonna go right back to Chef really quickly and I'll keep Marion on the line with me as well. We're gonna give you guys like two minutes to talk about the uh, uh, the cookbook or and obviously the ice cream book. It's ha it's homemade ice creams and frozen desserts by Marion Getz, introduction by Wolfgang Puck. And you know, Wolfgang, you and Marion have worked together for a long, long time. I love how she takes what you make and sort of takes it to the next level in her, in her books. Yeah. You know what is so amazing? Because Marianne is also a home cook. I have restaurants and pastry chefs like Gary is with me. Come over here, Gary. Say hello to everybody. He has his thing on. Hi, Gary. That's Gary. <laughs> yeah. All right. Show your nice face. All right. Okay, good. Look, and a handsome guy. But they're all hiding with the mask. Now, but Marianne made all our recipes. First, we have in big quantities into small quantities. Second, she makes it with uh, ingredients available for you at home, things mm -hmm. you have already in your refrigerator. So it makes it easy. You don't have to call somebody up. Where do I get this or where do I get that? She knows exactly what you can buy in your local supermarket and make the best dessert, the best ice cream. Nobody gonna believe you that you actually made that when you gonna become an ice cream maker, you're gonna have your ice cream store in your house. And if you have children, grandchildren, forget it. They won't leave their house. They will stay with you the whole day and says, I just want more ice cream, forget about uh, anything. And I know in my home, when I put the ice cream, I make it, I put it in the freezer, I wake up the next morning, go to work, come back home, the ice cream is gone. So I ask <laughs> Oliver, what did you do with my ice cream? He says, Papa, I couldn't sleep at night and I ate it. I was doing something on my computer. So <laughs> ice cream is loved by everyone. everyone. Oh, you know, for I sure. haven't found anybody yet who said, I don't like ice cream. Some people might say, I'm on a diet today, but then you make sorbets, pure fruit right. juice. Maybe with just a little bit of sugar, a little honey in it. 
and that's it. So you make a raspberry puree, a mango puree, sure. whatever you find, and you will have an amazing dessert. And I just want to show you two things. This is called Stripe Pops. Look how cute that is. And that's done with uh, Greek yogurt. And I love it up here, guys. She tells you lower fat, mixed base ahead, easy to modify. So you get tips on here. And then look at this one right on this side. Cracked chocolate shell ice cream. Hello, you had me at hello on that page, okay? <laughs> you had me at the word ice cream, quite frankly. Okay, so uh, Chef's gonna be with me for the next two hours. We have a spectacular show. In fact, we have his famous bowls that I own and love. Plus, we have his cookware sets coming up and a whole lot more. Stay right there if you wanna get the ice cream maker before it sells out today. I have journeyed around the globe. I've seen the beauty the world has to offer. Now, I'm bringing you new fabrics patterns and soft silhouettes with spicy details. Exotic, but with a new degree of sophistication. Global Chic is all about fashion freedom. So be free. Iman Global Chic, only on HSN. I'm on a hunt for the things that make life easier. You know, the products you can't live without. It's all about having the right tool for the right job. Come join me every Saturday at 7 a.m. to find out what makes me say, now that's clever. I hope that by revealing my true self, it inspires you to be brave and courageous. It's coming. It Cosmetics does things differently than any other beauty brand. We work with plastic surgeons and dermatologists to create real cosmetic solutions. We believe that every woman is beautiful. I just feel a whole lot better about myself. It transforms women's lives. I'm an it girl. You are an it girl. You are it. Don't miss It Cosmetics here on HSN. There are so many reasons to shop HSN during our Brands You Love Weekend. We're bringing our biggest names and brightest stars together just for you. Don't miss all your favorites now through Sunday on HSN and HSN.com. watching HSN and I'm Suzanne Runyon. What are we talking about? Well, two hours with one of the world-renowned chefs, Wolfgang Puck. I mean, it doesn't get much better than this. By the way, I have a lot of you on the line or you're on .com picking up the ice cream machine. Do it. You'll never regret it. That stuff is so darn good and it's so easy. If you're just channel surfing, Wolfgang Puck is with me and we will do another look at it coming up at the top of the hour. So if you wanna make homemade ice cream really easily, we've got the solution, so stick around to see that. But now we're gonna talk about his famous bowls. And you're like, really, would people make bowls a customer pick? You do when they're, th when they're this brilliant. Now this is a set of four bowls and you get the no spill lids, which are great. What I first love to show is everything is all inside the big bowl. So whether it's the lids and the bowls themselves, you put them all together. So it's super space saving. Also, we love the silicone nonstick on the bottom because that means the bowl's gonna stay flat. Notice too, it has a flat bottom so it doesn't rock around when you're trying to work with it. These are also are stainless steel and they do have inside, I'll show you one of these up here. Uh, there it is, right there, there it is. There, you even have your uh, measuring on the side so you know if you're filling it up, you don't have to dirty something else to actually do. I don't know, a mixture for ice cream, right? We have the blue, we have the red, and we have the black available. So we're gonna go back out to Los Angeles because Chef is where his prep kitchen is when he's doing his annual Oscar event. Is he still getting ready there? Okay, well, I'll tell you more about the bowls because I own them and I love these bowls. I'll tell you what, we love stainless steel because number one, unlike all the plastic gross bowls, they do not transfer taste nor do they turn colors. You ever had a bad plastic bowl and it turns orange or red the first time you used tomatoes in it or did a tomato sauce? That's never going to happen. They're sturdy and durable and yet they're lighter weight. So they're easy to move around. They're easy to work with. Because of that silicone bottom, this is so crucial, they stay put. They don't rock when you're trying to use a mix or you're trying to whisk something. They really stay put. And you can see that silicone. I'm moving my table around 
just by pushing on that bowl. How crazy is that, right? That's how awesome they are. And they are indeed a great customer pick. All right, Chef is ready. So Chef, we've been talking about your bowls for years and they continue to be one of your most popular items. Why do you think so? Well, why do I think so? Because it's stainless steel. It has the lids who seal up everything hermetically. So if you have garlic, if you have shrimps marinating, meat marinating in your refrigerator, the whole refrigerator smells like it. If you buy some smoked white fish or salmon and you put it in the refrigerator, it's gonna smell like that. So if you put it in one of my bowls, put the lid on and it's so great then. Look at that. Here I have some chicken marinating in here with soy like an Asian style, but look how well it actually seals it up. I can wear it. Look at it, I don't have to go to the hairdresser. I'm gonna wear my bowl. Here it is, the chicken in here. So why do I like it so much? Because it has a silicone bottom. So it doesn't move around on your table. If you wanna make a vinaigrette, mayonnaise, whatever it is, add a little vinegar. I have some shallots here, salt and pepper with our grinders here. I love fresh grinded pepper in my dressing and some good Himalayan sea salt. So, okay, now we're gonna whisk that, look at that. And I'm gonna add the olive oil with my other hand. And if you like a little mustard in it, here I have a little mustard. Voila, done. A little more oil. All right, so see that? I don't have to worry, my bowl is not running away from me. So now, if I don't, or if I make too much, I put the cover on it, the lid on it, and put it in the refrigerator so it won't smell my thing up. Or what I do here, I just pour it over my vinaigrette in my big bowl, put it around. Okay, that's enough. And then with the tongue, we stir it up a little bit. So if you have some vegetables, like in the summertime, you can get radishes, turnips, carrots, whatever it is, throw them into your salad, and you have a delicious little salad, easy and fast to do. Okay, Chef, Look you're getting, that. just so everybody know, you're getting a one, two, three, and five quart, or five cup, excuse me, so you're getting, or yep. five quart, excuse me, one, two, quart, three, and course, five yeah. quart, yeah. Uh, mixing bowls, you do get the matching lids, we have the three colors, and if you've got ratty old bowls, you know, the lids don't fit right, they're all burned or melted or stained or ripped or torn or whatever, just donate them, get rid of them, and get yourself a, a brand new set, and I'll tell you why, you're using these for years and years and years, because they're workhorses in your kitchen. Hey, Chef, one thing I love to do, and I'm going to do it right here, especially with your bowls, is when I do dressing, my favorite way of distributing the dressing is actually pouring it on, and you're like, well, how's it going to get down there below? And of course, you gently yeah. were folding it. I like taking the right. lid and then exactly. shaking it. That, to me, is the best way to distribute the dressing, exactly. but of course, I'm not a pro. Then I want you guys to see the chef. Can you show him and talk about this? You got a little secret hole right here in that one lid on the largest one. On, on the big one. So yeah. if you want to make whipped cream, if you want to make anything like uh, uh, whipped egg whites, for example, if you want to make meringue, and my son loves to make whipped cream. So do we have one of our whisk here? Yeah. See, you put the whipped cream in here. Do we have a little cream, eh, Gary? Okay, give me a little cream. So you go like that, and nothing gonna splatter all over. So that's what it's for. Oh my God, so fast. And now, look what I have to. Okay, Gary, you make the whipped cream. Now, this cook is also bakeware. Look at that. Here we bake a beautiful uh, loaf with sesame seeds, dark one and thing. And oh, here, nice. I'm marinating my chicken. Hey, Chef, um, um, what's the temperature your bowls can go up to in the oven? You can cook until 400 degrees in the oven. So you can cook any uh, uh, cake, bread, whatever you like. Without so the lid, obviously. Proof. Yeah, without the lid for sure. Now, yeah. look at that. Here, I have my chicken marinating and I just throw them on the grill. Now, if I would have ginger, garlic, onions, all of that stuff, 
on in my refrigerator with no lid on it, it would smell terrible. All right, Gary, what are you making? Whipped cream? Whipped cream in the oven, right? Okay. <laughs> All right. And I'm cooking here. Look at that. Everything marinating, shrimps and garlic. Now, I know now it's summertime. You probably have an outdoor grill, but you can keep that. And you know what I use that also for in the summertime when we do a buffet outside and the kids play around. What do I do? I keep all my salads and everything in the metal bowl. So that way, you don't have to worry if somebody tilts it over. Or one more thing I'm gonna show you. Look at that. You wanna make chocolate ganache. Heat up whipped cream over a double boiler and throw the chocolate in the cream. And you're gonna get chocolate ganache to make your chocolate cake, your chocolate souffle. You need a double boiler, but you need a you need a stainless steel bowl. Without the stainless steel bowl, forget it. Right, absolutely. And also that silicone on the base is gonna handle the heat of the oven, yeah. or of course it's a double exactly. boiler. All right, Chef, we gotta move on. I'm gonna remind everybody of our best value today. Oh my goodness, there's truly nothing better than delicious, chilly, cold, homemade ice cream on a really hot, sticky day. What would make it better? You made it yourself. And what would make that even better? It was super duper easy. No rock salt, no cranking, no having to pre freeze some weird container that you forgot to throw in there before your family's coming over for that picnic. None of that. You literally throw the ingredients in, pop it in this brilliant ice cream maker, turn it on and walk away and it does all the work for you. Now here's the scoop. We launched this and this is hilarious to me. We launched it in white only for $20 more in February, the, one of the coldest months in the year and it totally sold out because it's brilliant, right? Who didn't love ice cream all year long, right? Well, tonight we brought it back, added three additional new colors which is red, aqua, and mint, and brought the white back. Listen to this. We lowered it $20, added five flex pay, and added free shipping. So if you'd like yours, right now we have sold almost 700 in just this hour, guys. That's a whole lot of a very limited quantity that we actually brought in. If you are thinking about it with the flex pay, it's 30 bucks right now. You pay it off in five months. We ship it to you right away. You're going to make a whole lot of great homemade ice cream, yogurts, sorbet, frozen and drinks if you want to in that fabulous machine and basically it is effortless now to be able to do that that's a memory maker I mean that's just something that goes beyond like I said some of my favorite memories if you didn't hear me when we did the presentation some of my most acute memories and heck I can barely remember what I had for lunch or one time we made crank homemade ice cream and while it took forever I'll never forget the experience and the results were amazing and number two my dad used to take us on the weekends gave us a dime and we could get an ice cream cone at the local Dairy Delish that's what it was called uh, and again very fond memories surrounding something so delicious you're going to be able to create that with our machine now if you missed out on the presentation we'll take another look in about 20 minutes but before we do that we've got these now you know what's interesting is in the two hours with chef tonight you're you're going to see customer pick after customer pick after customer pick and this is another another one of his all-time iconic items and it's his brilliant spice mills they're easy to operate you get a set of two with these and these are done in stainless steel as well we have this beautiful beautiful metallic midnight blue we have the pink up front this is the rose gold in the back which is gorgeous and everybody loves the metallic red you get two of these in the set so two spice mills you get two individual boxes so if you are thinking of doing a housewarming gift or a thank you gift for somebody who's maybe helped you out you can wrap them up individually and of course you're going to get the user guide very easy to use those these are simple you just literally press the top the light comes on and you can adjust the thickness or the coarseness or fineness of whatever it is you might be actually using as a spice so let's go back out to LA and chef Wookang Puck who's joining us again and chef again this oh. is one of your customer pick iconic items you really recommend Thanks. freshly Thanks. ground spices salts and peppers don't you only that's the only way you know i go and do catering in some of these places a million dollar home and they buy the pepper and all the spices already ground sometimes you i ask the housekeeper how when did you buy them they said i don't know maybe last year maybe two years ago i don't know so when you have fresh peppercorn for example you can toast them a little bit even if they're a year old you grind them and they will taste amazing so with this machine, you can make it really fine, like I do here. You can see that I have 
our own mixture of pepper here. You can get that too here. Look how beautiful fine. Red, the pink, black, white pepper, bright green pepper. And then it's just as important to have good salt. You know, you don't want iodized salt, so you buy some good sea salt and you put it on it. Now, what I like, for example, if I use a pepper steak, you can see here, look at my beautiful beef here. So I use coarse pepper. See that? So for a pepper steak, that's the best way. And naturally, we're gonna also put a little coarse ground salt on here. So now you have a pepper steak. If you wanna cook fish, what you're gonna do is you're gonna use the fine ground pepper. Here we have a little salmon and some halibut. So what do I do? I'm gonna use the fine pepper here. So that way people don't think you didn't clean your kitchen or something was wrong. See that how easy it is? With two fingers, it is battery powered, you don't have to worry. And I use them also for my table. My boys, Alexander and Oliver, don't like pepper a lot because they are young kids still. So I like it, but this, you have a light in here. You can see that? All right, so where's my camera, this one? I don't know. Are you up there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Can we see the, the light? Yep. Okay. You see it here. Okay, good. So, you know how much pepper or how much salt you put on your meat, your fish, your salad. But you get the aroma of fresh ground pepper. It's so much better than the ones you would buy. So, For sure. if you want to yeah. season your food the way we do in the restaurant, this is a must. But for me, you also can get our, our Himalayan salt here. And one of my favorite is the hickory the, smoke uh, salt. So and, if, and you wanna give, if you want to give something the flavor, smokiness, like barbecue, use that salt and it tastes delicious. And, and I want to show Chef these guys pepper. what you're talking about. This is the Himalayan pink salt. This is your peppercorn, hickory smoked salt. And this is a King's pepper blend. Those are available. Yeah. We've got four flex plays, uh, pays on that. But Chef, we're going to wrap it up because coming up next, we have a showstopper. I am so excited about this because I've never done this with them. I'm pumped to talk about it. It is called the Weekender. You're like, or the Weeknighter pot with the lid. This is one of your favorites. And tonight we have the lowest price we've ever offered. It's on sale and we're talking a huge on sale price so we're going to do that right now am i moving on guys we got to move on okay let's do it okay so <clears throat> i even have the reviews on this one we have two do i have both choices is the question do i because i'm only seeing the six cup do i have the 12 cup available stand by because on my notes i have a 12 cup Oh, oh, of course it is. <laughs> All right, yeah, it is under here. All right, now I got the 12 cup. Here we go. So we actually have two choices tonight. You actually have the sip, six cup and we have the 12 cup. Normally, the six cup is $34.95 and it has become a favorite. It's a customer pick. We have dropped it down to $19.99. That's a huge savings. Now on the 12 cup, this is now down to $39.99 and it's called the weeknighter pot. <clears throat> you get the lid to go with it. And I love it because you do get the colander style lid and there's a little pour spout and you've got this great little handle. So again, the one we're featuring mainly is the $19 one. We do have the double the size if you want for $39.99. Chef, did it surprise you this became a customer pick so quickly? You know what? It's such a comfortable little pan, little pot. You can use it for anything. If you wanna make a little oatmeal in the morning, if you have to cook a few vegetables, if it's peas or beans, what is so great, it has the colander lid. Look at that here, see that? So now, I don't need another colander if I wanna pour off the water. I just hold that and strain it off so it's really easy. And then give me a little piece of butter if we have it, add a little butter to my piece and I have a perfect side dish. See that, look at that, nothing left in here. Put it back on my, on my stove here, heat it up, and that's it. So simple, I even can serve it in there. Heating up a little tomato sauce, how easy it is. I had some leftover pasta here, I warmed it up, and now I'm gonna put a little bit of my tomato sauce on here, 
and have a little pasta bolognese here. So easy, fast, and no problem. Go to the dishwasher, so you have everything you will need. See that? Yeah, it's just an awesome size and shape. Hey, Chef, there's a gal yeah. uh, named uh, Fly in California, and she says the best part is the colander lid. It's great when she's cooking eggs, veggies, pasta, yeah. or anything you want to drain. So some hard-boiled eggs, and you want to drain those out, it's perfect for that. Making a little bit of pasta, perfect for that. And again, here's your six quart, or six cup. Now, the six cup is the best value, by the way. We were $34.95. We're down to $19.99. On the 12 cup, it was originally $49. Now we're down to 39 so your biggest savings is here i think this makes an exceptional gift idea maybe you've had someone over the last couple of months who's really helped you out they've gone to the groceries they've done a lot of stuff for you you're giving them the quality of one of the world's most famous chefs wolfgang puck he does not put his name on it unless he loves it he tests it he makes sure it's good for his kitchen so he knows it's going to be fabulous for your kitchen so if you really want to give a very affordable gift to someone who has been helping you out maybe going to the store for you because you wear it a little nervous going out this would be the most perfect gift to give well marion is a pastry chef and also a sous, a sous chef for wolfgang so we're going to jump here to tampa and talk to marion about her favorite reasons why this is a must-have in the kitchen what do you think marion oh my gosh suzanne you and i both adore this little pot it's just so cute and then when you really look at it, you're like, oh my gosh, this is the exact construction of all of the bigger sets of cookware that Wolfgang has. From the tri-ply bottom to those riveted on handles, I love it because he did that perfect construction, but that it's so darn cute and that it fits perfectly on that little burner on the stove. You know, the one, the little one that you don't really use. Right. But because it's Wolfgang, it's that stainless that just lasts and lasts, can go right into the oven, into the freezer, but he didn't skimp on the details. I love this. It's my teapot any other time, and it sits on my stove, but great I also idea. use it for all the baking, too. Oh, that's a great idea as a teapot. I love that. Mm -hmm. Also, if you're serving soup, I even thought about if you're going to make a whole lot of, um, I don't know, little summer beverages, this would be awesome to serve the beverages out of it. Like, to me, you almost have to get this. Like, it's so cute, but it's so darn versatile, and you'll see the five-star review after five-star review on it at $34.95, not $19.99, and for flex you can get this home actually for five dollars if you order tonight while it's available on sale for the first time it's our customer pick it's never been a better value and marion to your point you know you really when you're baking with something like this you know you know it's going to last and it's going to give you great results because wolfgang has exacting standards and you know when you have a shape like that suzanne what I love is now you have something that's better built than all the cake pans out there anyway, and it's not a unitasker. I really appreciate when things do more than one thing, but Wolfgang, I love what he says about this, Suzanne. He says, it's a ladies' pot, and maybe <laughs> it is because we see cuteness first, sure. and you know, I think now when you stay home so much, I appreciate even more all of the things in my kitchen that make it the best room in the house from my, my oven that's Wolfgang, from all the different things that I have. But this one makes me smile every day because it's so functional. It's beautiful, it's professional, and yet it does all those little things that make me happy. Okay, a couple things. Note, we do have, this is the one that's on the biggest sale, which is the six cup. We also have the 12 cup if you wanna go bigger, and I'll show you, it'll double the size. Isn't this awesome? But there is something just so adorable, like you almost kinda have to have this one. Now also, just so you'll know, if you would need some new utensils, and we all do, we actually have a set of four stainless steel utensils that are available tonight. I know we've got flex on these, so I'm just pointing out a lot of variety in the show so you can see obviously chef brings us a lot of great things for our kitchen but this is the gem and we are getting super duper busy and we knew it was going to be a lot of fun if you're thinking hot chocolates that you want to pour on a chilly winter night or maybe you turn around and it's that great cup of tea that you're going to make and you're going to use this to serve tea maybe it's iced tea maybe you love making cold, cold brew coffee that would be kind of fun in here maybe it is that margarita and you're serving up the gang when they come over for that barbecue maybe it is that hot cup of soup that you just want that hearty soup. Maybe it is the pasta or boiled eggs and you want to use that strainer because the colander is built in. All of this is going to, I think, find, you'll find an everyday use for this guy. Like, I don't think this is ever going to come off your stovetop simply because it's a great size, it's a great silhouette, and it's just a hardworking little gem for your kitchen. So, Chef, what are some of the other
other ideas that you can think of that we could use well, this for? I, I do so many things with that. First of all, it has riveted handle. It has the colander lid and it has a tri-ply bottom, which is really amazing because that way you have really even cooking or baking or whatever it is. So really look at that. This is really for me the most important part. So if it's just some vegetables here, like I have peas, look at them in here. If it's boiling a few hard boiled eggs to put in my salad, I just have to pour off the water through the calendar lid and it makes it so much simpler. So this is really a great little pot. If you wanna heat up water for your tea, for your coffee press, if you have the French press, look at that. So there's no, nothing left in here. Like here, I made my tomato sauce or my bolognese sauce for my pasta. So you serve a little bowl of pasta just like that. I made it for the whole family. Look at that. Then, wanna watch a movie? Everybody is out there watching movies. We have popcorn. Oh, look in here. That's a great idea. I, I know, I'm gonna put a little pepper on it. I love pepper. <laughs> and a little touch of truffle oil. Oh, nice, yeah, hello. Okay, so you're done, <laughs> or if you want, you can put butter on it. I, I like fresh butter on it too, so that's gonna be amazing. And you nibble and nibble it, and it's delicious. And don't forget, we also bake in here. Oh, that's awesome. See that? Look at it. And look how even the cooking is, how even the baking, everywhere, the same color. That's what you want in great cookware. I think what's so also now, nice about if you want. Go ahead, Chef. Yeah, if you can decorate it, put berries on top, whipped cream on top, whatever you like. And something you want to think about, too, is maybe you have people coming over, and this is how you serve the potato salad. Because I'll tell you, just using yeah. it on the table, and everybody, because it's the handle. It's grabbing that handle and being able to get out the potato salad. Maybe during the holidays, this is how you heat up your gravy for your mashed potatoes and the turkey. Um, I think you'll just find a gazillion uses for this in your kitchen. Also, think about giving this as that gift. It's the neighbor who's been so good for, to you during this crazy time we're in. You know, it's the person who's really done a lot for you right now. And you just want to say thank you, but you don't want to spend a fortune, but it looks like you did, then this is it. If you were to go to a gourmet food store, like a gourmet place, something like this, these specialty pans that are so unusual and yet so useful can run you, put another one in front of that 19 easily in a gourmet shop or a high-end kitchen shop. And here you're getting something that's made so beautifully, made to last. Just show you right through you do have your measuring right there, uh, little, little, there, can you see it? Right there, so you can see this goes up, obviously, to uh, six cups. And um, it's $19.99, plus you have four flex pays. You can get it home on any major credit card for $5 right now. Also, you have a small colander side on this side of the lid, which is built in, and then you turn it over and it gives you a large one. So again, you get the kind of variety you're looking for all in what Marion said, which is the cutest darn thing. Like, every kitchen should have this. And I think once you get it, you're going to go, oh, she was right. This really is useful, like, when you think about it. And, Chef, I, I love it. I also especially love the shape of this. It's just a really great-looking pan. Me too. Now, look at that. We have a little pound cake. You have a birthday coming up. Uh, up. Somebody comes over. You don't need to find a birthday cake or anything somewhere which costs you a fortune. You can decorate it yourself. See, put that on and maybe a few sprinkles or what do we have here? Here, voila, if it's for a little, for a little kid. Okay, and here we go, we have a nice little cake. So if you want, put <coughs> chocolate sauce on it, anything you like. So you know what, this will be so helpful for you at home. Yeah. You know, you know what you're missing on that cake? Hello, where's the ice cream yeah. we just made? Oh my God, yeah, bring me a little ice cream and I will eat it. You know what, I'm gonna have one more, one more time, we're gonna show you the ice cream maker, so I will eat it with my cake. There we go, You're right. okay. <laughs> All right guys, so we're gonna wrap up on this. Please stay right there, go to hsn.com, it's a couple of clicks and you'll get it. This is gonna be the little, this is like the little engine that could. You're gonna get it home and go, dang on it, they were right, this thing is so handy. All right, and it's on sale for the very first time. Read the reviews, if you don't believe me, read the other customers' reviews, because they love it too and I love it for a little sport of tea you want to do a little sport of tea of course we can all right here we go so what's happening next well chef launched a brilliant ice cream machine 
nothing like it out there. It's coming up next. It's our today's special. He launched it in February, just on a show. Not a today's special. $20 more sold out in white. We brought it back. We made the deal even better. Added some more goodies, some new colors. And the results are the most delicious ice cream that you will make easily at home, on call, when you want it. That's coming up in just a second. And it is our very best value today. So let's take another look at it.